This is a radio tape player that I took apart a few years ago. What I did was I cut the wires that went to the speaker, snipped them off here, and I put clips on them. And I have them mounted over here to a device that I bought at Radio Shack. I don't know what you call it, but it's kind of like a quick connect. So um, I can hook up from the outside of the radio for a uh, cone uh, speaker. But uh, what I had to do is take this apart and clip these wires because I found if I left them on and connected from here that I couldn't get the volume needed for my uh, tape player to uh, use for uh, predator hunting. So I'm going to put this thing back together and hopefully it's going to work and I'll show you the outside of it. This is a part I bought from Radio Shack and attached to the, the radio. I had to cut a hole in it to, to get it to mount. But uh, screw that on. Nuts on the back side of it. And these allow me to plug my wires into them. Quick disconnect. So I don't have to mess around with the inside of the uh, radio tape player anymore. All I have to do is do my connections from the outside. So next step is I bought the speaker from Radio Shack, the power horn. It was only it was on sale. It was only uh, I don't know fourteen dollars or so. I think I got it for much less than that. And I also bought a hundred foot reel of wire. So as you can speaker wire. So as you can see, I have the uh, the speaker mounted to the top of the reel so it's all one unit and I just use the crimp connectors to do that with so here's the speaker here's the wire um, 100 feet I'm good out to uh, say 33 yards uh, I'll set this speaker up maybe oh 25 28 yards from uh, where I'm going to hunt from so that's the next phase. Okay, I plugged in my wires and I've got this uh, I've got a coyote distress tape in here. So we'll see how this sounds. And here we go. I got it on. I got got plenty of volume, and the reason I uh, when I first put this thing together, I wasn't getting that much volume because the speaker wires were hooked up to the actual speaker, and uh, even splicing into them, it wasn't loud. So I found once I cut them, I could get some volume out of this bugger. So it'll uh, it'll make an attraction. <laughs> And here's a few tapes I have. I've got the baby jackrabbit, young gray fox, coyote locator. Oop. What am I looking at here? Getting the wrong ones. Cottontail rabbit, coyote locator, gobbler distress, coyote pup distress, <coughs> yellow. Uh, Hammer Woodpecker, Canine Puppies, I have bought this thing here at uh, Walmart one time I sale. The thing went for about 30 bucks and they had it marked down to 7. It's got Jackrabbit, Cottontail, Coyote Pup, and Squealing Cottontail, all in a crow fight. So, uh, got a few tapes. So, didn't take much. It was just no radio sitting around. Radio tape player. Get a little uh, monkey around and uh, the baby works fine. So you can make one cheaper than you can buy one. Did it, did it, did it, did it. That's all, folks.